like a hell cut. Alright, hey what's up guys, Logan here from Toxicity. Now today I'm here to talk to you about a little bit of a problem I just encountered. If you see this, this is a uh, foot off of my PC case and there were four little pins there I guess you could call them. They stuck up in the bottom of the case and kind of expanded it and, and locked there. So those all broke off on both front feet. So I've already tested this once to prove my concept, and it works extraordinarily well. All you're going to need is some sort of screw, a nut, and a washer. So these washers are a little bit big, I don't need those, so I'm just going to use this washer for now. Um, so you're going to want to take your hot glue gun, and there's a little bit of a cavity there in your uh, PC foot. But, you know, yours might not be exactly like this, but this is just for any feet that look like this. So, if you take your hot glue gun and just really quickly pour some hot glue in the bottom. Now, I'm having a bit of an issue pouring it. Uh, this might be bad. Okay, I'm just going to stick it in there now. Now, I just stick it in there and it kind of starts to pool around, that's okay, because we're going to want that. Alright, now, just kind of fill in the gaps here, try to get as much hot glue around. Now, you don't have to use hot glue. I personally prefer hot glue for just about anything. It's probably the easiest to work with in my mind. So, this is a lot messier than the other PC foot. I wish I actually just recorded that one instead but you know this still proves a point here we go you can see I've filled in that little gap with hot glue we're gonna let this dry now so it doesn't create any issues when we're trying to put it in there just got it back behind the camera here blowing on it I think I used a little too much hot glue maybe it's a lot more than I used on the last one and that one holds fine so Again, going to have to give this a minute to dry off, but I'm just going to hold it up to the camera here so you guys can see what I've done so far. I just stuck a little bit of hot glue down there, put in the screw, and then a little more hot glue on top to hold it in just nice. Now, if I'm right on this, this should hold better than the original PC feed did. That's just me. It might, you know, just fall apart completely, but I really think this will hold better because it's metal and glue and then more metal so instead of just you know those little tiny thin cheap little plastic pins that went in there originally all right well i think it's done drying i've kind of cleaned off just a little bit of this excess glue and holds really well it's you know pretty much solid just got a little bit of give to it because it's you know rubbery but we have all the parts it's all put together now we just need to install it you have your PC case over here, and you can see there's a missing foot right here, and that's this foot. I've already installed the other one on the other side. All you're going to need to do is put it in there after taking the side of your PC off, of course. Then put the washer on top, kind of center it so the washer falls down, and now we're going to want to put... Let's bring you guys a little bit closer here so you can see more what I'm doing. Uh, yeah. And just screw on that little nut as tight as you can. Finger tightness should do. You can use tools, but really I think you shouldn't need more than a screwdriver if you're putting together a PC. And, yep, since you have the washer in there. I'll just bump the camera. Since you have the washer in there, it should keep the nut from unscrewing itself. So there's no need in actually using tools to tighten this. So yeah, there you go. You have a perfectly new and improved usable PC foot. And again, if I'm right, should hold better than the original. Again, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Still